and it lasts when it's finished. Put up in the air. Hey, how you doing, Vice Captain? Mind if I take a seat? Relax, I'm not gonna hit on a guy. Most days. Yeah, he's a bi. Yeah, he's a bi. Gil told me what happened during the mission out in the wastes. About the red rain and you jumping into a beat up God Ark soldier to go save your friend? It's crazy. Yes, I did. <laughs> you take everything in stride. That's nice. Real nice. Look, I, I came to talk about Gil. I'm betting he hasn't said much about himself, huh? Uh, I'm just supposed to. Plus, I bet you're aching to know what happened back in Scotland. Not really. Was if you're gonna tell him all ears. Not so. No, the Glasgow branch is small. I mean, like tiny. There were only three God Eaters stationed there. Gil and I, of course, and the third was our team's captain. Her name was Kate. Kate Lawry. She, uh, she was my fiance. Uh -huh. There weren't a ton of origami attacks out there. So the three of us managed just fine most days. A routine mission came up on the board and... Well, it should have been routine. I'm gonna be straight with you. This is about to get kind of heavy. Do you want me to keep going? Okay, well... Yeah, let's get it on with. <sighs> Tell me about your troubles. During that operation, Gil was forced into a really bad position. There was no other option. He was found not guilty at the tribunal, but people still talk, you know? That's where he got his little nickname. Fragging Gil. Cowards. As if any of them had the right to call him that. As if they had the right to blame him. Yeah, the right to blame him. Back to the story. We played the fight like normal. Kate and Gil paired up as the advance, and I circled around the flank. That's okay. when it appeared. I think got a face like Ultraman Orb. It's Aragami. It's a new species. It's too strong. Can you hear me, Haru? Please, just hurry. Get your ass back over here, Haru. Not going fast enough, Haru. Oh, uh, there goes a shield. Oh, but she got the black flag. Kate, get away from it. Just, just focus on healing. I'll hold it off. Kate, your armlet, it's corroding. I'll be fine. Kate, your armlet. It's burning. You have to get out of here, all right? Leave this monster to me. I'll hold it back.
Lice. Slide. Jump. Damn. You missed like the Matrix. Get the hell up out of here. has already begun. I can feel it. Gil, you, you know you have to do it. I won't. We, we can still get back. I, I don't, I don't think so. Gil, I'm sorry. You have to tell him. Look. No. Don't make me do it. Sorry, I know I'm, I'm just being selfish. Why well, kill her? You know you want to. Meant to leave you. you kill her. You know you want to. Kill. I don't want to hurt you. Go ahead, kill her. Don't let myself hurt you. Kill her. Please, kill. Or you want to kill her? I'm begging you. It's just me. It's just kind of funny though. Like. <laughs> It's like their facial expressions aren't even matching their emotions well enough for me to feel any type of like feeling towards this scene. This is just laughable. Too late. Kate was already long gone. Blood stained the ground. The fabric of her clothes crushed deep into the dirt. Uh huh. And stone. Gil was clutching her armlet to his chest. And he wouldn't look at me. He... What if that's the armlet he put on his other arm? Sorry to be so dark. That's enough for today. Yeah. Yeah. You're a good listener, you know? No, I don't try to be. serious look. It's easy to open up. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Maybe Gil can see that honesty in your eyes. Maybe. You know? Maybe. It even reminds him of Kate. Well, enough of that, right? Right. Day was pretty good. Oh, it wasn't. Let's have another drink sometime. Uh-huh. See ya. Uh, yeah, I don't want to see you anymore, so... That was so. 